hear all those goldfinches up in the trees? That's so awesome. Spring is here. Migration has started. So, Craig Kasmer back here again at Hartwick Pines, and we're going to be talking about um, some invasive species that um, are in the next couple videos. We're going to focus on the hemlock woolly adelgid in this video, and it affects the hemlock trees that we have in Michigan. Now, we've got thousands of hemlock trees here at Hartwood Pines, and they're all relatively healthy. But in other areas of the state, they're under attack by this little insect. We'll talk about that in a minute. First, we need to figure out where the range is of the eastern hemlock. So, get out your Michigan map. I'll wait. You got it? Ready? Okay. Got it, got it handy, right? Here it is. So, here's your Michigan map. So, all of the Upper Peninsula, you'll find hemlock. And here in the northern lower peninsula, you'll find the hemlock as well. And down along the coastline of Lake Michigan. And so in counties like Allegan, uh, Ottawa, Oceana, Muskegon, and now recently Mason County, they're seeing an outbreak of this hemlock woolly adelgid. What do they look like? Oh, yeah, the adelgid. Well, um, the adelgid is a tiny little white in insect. And they call it woolly adelgid because it's got this white woolly fuzz on it. And it's really, 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 really tiny. If you've ever seen an aphid, they look a lot like an adelgid. And if you don't know what an aphid is, they look a lot like an, like an adelgid. Does that make sense? Anyway, hemlocks, as we know, keep their lower branches. And so they're found on the underside of the branches or of the, the leaves itself or the needles. And I'll zoom in here and we'll see what they look like. Those little white dots, those are supposed to represent the hemlock woolly adelgid. And they suck the juice out of those needles, which weakens the tree, and then a tree eventually will, will die, unfortunately. And so up in the northeastern states from Michigan, like in Pennsylvania and, and further up there, they've lost thousands and thousands of these trees to hemlock woolly adelgid. So we want to stop it from spreading here in Michigan. So in the next video, we're going to talk about what we're doing to fight and battle this little bugger. 